Well, hey, yogis, I'm Melanie, and welcome to St. John's, Newfoundland. I'm here at Nova Yoga Studio, and it is officially spring, so today a practice to ring in spring. Let's make our way to the mat. And we're going to start standing. And we're going to start in Tadasana in Mountain Pose. I'd like you to take a little wider stance so the feet are about hip width, maybe a little wider. And we're going to move through our sun salutation A with some real nice chest, heart, shoulder opening. So brightening up the body, taking a deep breath in, letting it out through the mouth. And inhale, take your arms wide, out and up, reaching for the sky. Exhale, take your hands behind you, interlace your fingers. Inhale, roll your shoulders back, lift your heart up. And exhale, bending your knees, coming forward into the bound version of your fold. And holding here as you lift your knuckles to the sky, relax your neck, your head. And taking your hands to your lower back, massaging all the way down the length of your legs. Lift your spine halfway, palms to shins or fingers in line with toes. And we're going to take it down into hands and knees. So this first round, we're just going to add in some nice cat-cow. Wrists under shoulders, knees under hips. Inhale, shoulders onto the back. Heart rising, tailbone lifting. And exhale, press into the ground, round your spine. Inhale. And exhale. the heart and exhale enjoy how delicious delicious it is to really round and stretch out through the spine one more cow pose open the heart and then take it back downward dog and this first downward dog let's just move around and opening up to your mouth sticking at your tongue Walking your dog, pedaling out the heels. You want to lift your legs, open your hips, rotate your ankles, spread your toes. Anything that's going to allow you to feel awake and alive. And holding steady here for a big breath in. Out through your mouth. And bringing your feet together. Look forward, lift your heels, bend your knees, and let's walk up to the hands. So we're going to walk for this first round. Lift and lengthen your spine. And bow down into your fold. Rise, take your arms wide, out and up, reaching for the sky. And take your hands behind your back, interlace your fingers. Roll your shoulders back, lift your heart up for that spring awakening. And then bend your knees, take it forward, knuckles rising to the sky. And taking your hands to your lower back and massaging down the length of your legs. Lift your spine halfway, Ardha Uttanasana. Step it back, plank pose. Breathe in. Exhale, lower down. Option to take your knees to the mat, hug your elbows into the ribs. Untuck your toes, roll your shoulders back, lift your chest, cobra or upper dog, let the light in. And then curl your toes under, press back, downward dog. Breathe in, take your right leg to the sky, straight back behind you. Exhale, bring it in, knee to nose, shift shoulders over your wrists, core plank. Inhale, stretch your leg back. Exhale, hug your knee in, step your foot all the way up to meet your thumb. We'll rise to high lunge, so feet are hip width, back heel stays lifted, and reach for the sky. And make this pose lovely and long, strong, vibrant, bright. This new season is about hope, awakening, light, optimism. So really infuse your lunge with, with all those ideas, those qualities. And bring your hands together down into the heart center. And let's open up. So as you inhale, take your arms wide, stretch out through the fingertips, open up the chest. And then as you exhale, hug in, almost like you're rounding your spine, wrap your arms around yourself. Again, inhale, opening up. Open up to the light. And exhale, rounding, hugging in. One more time. Inhale, expanding even more. And exhale. Take your 
arms wide out and up, reach for the sky. And take your hands down to frame your foot low in the lunge. Take your right arm to the sky, twist open, hold it here. You can lift your arms straight up, or if you want to lean it back a little bit more, you can. And feel that this twist is, is providing you with some spring cleaning, so you're wringing out any heaviness, any tensions, toxins, anything that, that needs to go. Take your hand down to the mat, lift your right leg to the sky, bend your knee, open up your hip, drop it back, rock star, ball of the foot behind you, press up through your hips, lean it back. Hand to the mat, guide your knee in, step your foot all the way up to meet your thumb, warrior two. Anchor that back heel, sweeping the arm up and overhead, and arriving in the pose and the adjustments you need to make. Heel to arch alignment, lunging deeply into that front thigh, open hips, open heart, strong center, and express. Open the front palm, take it back, peaceful warrior. And then taking it forward, side angle, you can take it to the thigh, or if you wish, you can go deeper, reaching down to the ground. We're going to take this lifted arm, place it long and low, back by the thigh. We're going to swivel the chest open. So inhale, sweep the horizon, arm travels forward. Exhale, work the arm up and around. Let's take it again. Inhale. Exhale. One more time. Inhale. Exhale, now work the arm around the back. You can hold on to the thigh. You can snuggle the hand to the side waist. Curl the sitting bone under, lean your chest back. And then rise all the way back up into warrior two. Hands down to frame your foot and sweep that right leg to the sky straight back behind you. Now walk your hands back, walk your foot hands all the way back to your standing foot. Slow and steady. Now hug that right knee into the belly and rise to stand all the way onto that left leg. We're going to find our way into dancer, one of my favorite balancing postures, Natarajasana. So you're going to reach back, hold the inside edge of that lifted foot, and then draw the heel in line with your body. Create a circle with the finger and thumb, reach the arm forward, and you're going to extend your leg back. You're going to press your foot into your hand, and as the leg extends back, the heart will soar forward. You feel like you're moving forward confidently, brilliantly into this new season and all of its possibilities. Releasing the pose, the knee hugs in, the arms lift up, seesaw down, hands to the mat, keep the leg lifted, and walk your hands forward into down dog split. Bend your knee, open up your hip, look under the armpit. And then bring your knee and step your foot forward. High lunge, feet are hip width, rise on up. From here, we're gonna take a twist, bring your hands together down into the heart center. Hinging at hips, take your torso forward, belly in, tailbone drops. And then our, our obliques spin us to the right into that twist. Press your elbow into your outer thigh, lean your chest back, and instead of having the hands hanging out by the armpit, press your elbow into the outer thigh and spin open so your hands are right at heart center. Now from here, you can take your top arm to the sky, lifting triumphantly. If you can, or if you wish to try it, take your left fingertips to the outside of that right foot, Open up. Try and straighten out for that back leg. Shift your right hip back. Maybe even look up, it's tricky. And then press your palms together, look down. Frame your foot with your hands, plank pose. Oh, step it back, breathe in. Exhale, lowering down. Inhale, rolling open through the heart. Exhale, pressing back through the hips. Big breath in, and out with a sigh. Left side, inhale, left leg to the sky. Exhale, hug it in, knee to nose, core strengthening. 
Inhale the leg back. Exhale, bring your knee in. Step your foot up to meet your thumb. We're going to rise high lunge. Feet are hip width. And reach for the sky. And again, make this lunge strong, powerful, vibrant, bright. And press your palms together. Take the hands down in front of the heart. Inhale, go wide. Spread open through the arms. Lift through the heart. And exhale, again, rounding your back. Inhale. And exhale. One more moment of awakening here. Inhale, open up. And exhale. Give yourself that nice, sweet hug. Take your arms wide out and up. Hands come down to frame the foot low in the lunge. Place your right hand and lift your left arm to the sky. Maybe leaning back into that detoxifying twist. Lower your hand down. Take that left leg to the sky, straight up and back. Bend your knee, open up your hip. Drop the ball of the foot behind you. Rock star. And then hand to the mat to guide your knee in. Step your foot forward to the thumb, warrior two. Line up your feet. Straighten out that back foot. And when will the arms open? And you arrive. Hold there for a moment. Any adjustments you need to make. Power up your center. Open up through your chest. Look forward and set your sights on something out over those front fingertips. Open your front palm, stretch it back, peaceful warrior. And taking it forward to the thigh or to the mat, side angle. Taking your hand long and low. Inhale, sweep the arm forward. Exhale, work it up and around. Inhale. Exhale. One more inhale. Exhale, wrapping the arm around the back, rolling open through your chest, half bind. And then floating up into your warrior two. Circle your hands down to frame your foot. Stretch your left leg to the sky, straight back. And then walk your hands all the way back to your standing leg. Take your time to rise, hugging that left knee into your chest. Come all the way up. Reach back, hold the inside edge of your foot, draw the heel in line with your body. Extending your arm forward, press your foot into your hand, and as the leg reaches back, your heart will soar forward. And then guiding your knee in, reaching the arms up. Seesaw down, hands to the mat, keep the leg lifted, walk all the way forward. Bring your knee in, step your foot up. High lunge, reach for the sky. Press your palms together in front of the heart. Hinge at hips, come forward, belly in, tailbone drops. Spin into that twist. Position your hands at the center of the chest. Free your left arm up. Maybe take your right fingertips to the outside of that left foot. Open up, maybe we even look up. And then bringing your hands together, look down. Hands to the mat, step back, downward dog. In through your nose, out through your mouth. And then hopping through and coming into a cross-legged seat, into any comfortable position. And allow yourself to set some intentions for this new season. Happy spring, and I hope you have a great few months. Shanti.